Hello YouTube. So when I bought this Yezu FT470, I basically didn't know what was the frequency range on it because the guy who was selling the radio to me uh, was not a radio operator. So yeah, it was a little bit, you know, when you're buying uh, things in a box, you don't know what you're buying. So what you get, that's it. You don't have, you know, uh, you can't make a complaint because this is the decision you, you made, you know. So bottom line, what kind of frequency I can go on this on this radio? As you can see, the on VHF, let me zoom. On VHF, the bottom frequency is 140. And let's step through the frequencies by 1 megahertz using a dial. This is some interference from computer. And what happens right now is that uh, when you drop the function key after, after timeout, you will go uh, to kilohertz. But when you press the FM, you will go with megahertz. See? So from four, 140 up to, up to 174. There you go. 174. And that's about it on uh, VHF. If we switch that with UHF, you can go from 430 to 440. At least I can go in this specific uh, situation. See? 43 and up by 1. This is pretty this is pretty much it, you know. So I don't know if this was standard like when the Yezu was bought or that was some kind of hack or something because obviously on VHF you know I can go a little bit down uh, than I need. Uh, if you do have any kind of information about this, about modes, about hacks, about frequency expander or what is the term in English, whatever, uh, please write that in the comment section because I think that uh, the whole FT series of this Yezu devices uh, you basically can hack in similar way probably because you know this is the similar line of product so I don't know if you have any kind of information about how to expand this thing safely please write it in a, in a comment section below so thank you for watching and uh, thank you for subscribing and I'm looking forward into making uh, one of these videos about especially about Yezu because I started to really really enjoy uh, using it so Thank you for watching and uh, see ya, see ya in a, one of the future videos. And sorry for my English, I'm not nature natural speaker or uh, English is not my mother tongue or whatever the term is. So excuse me for this. Sometimes I just babble sentences that doesn't even sense uh, even for me. So yeah, sorry. See you in next video.